Hello, 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 guys. Welcome back to another episode of The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. As always, I am Mixalon, and it is greed mode day. We're going down to greed mode. I was trying to see what changed on the screen, because, like, normal to hard, you had the red and, like, tints the corners. But then you go to greed mode, it keeps it tinted on the corners, but you lose the red. But you also gain these penny cent symbols around here. Anyways, that's just, that's neither here nor there. We're just going to random. We're going to play whoever the game wants us to play. I'm on board with whatever they choose. Isaac D6 sounds like a great start to a greed mode. What do you got for me in here? Regeneration, kind of on board. I want to check the other consumables and items that we have, make sure we're on top of stuff. I think we might save Hogalaws. Possibly. Uh, there's not really a whole lot here. We're gonna, obviously going to blow up this. Blow up every fortune teller machine in greed mode is kind of just my... My modus operandi. Yeah, these rocks don't really seem super good. I think I'm okay with taking regeneration and some HP up. That'll help against a lot of things. You know, it's not any early damage, but it works. Crush these guys. We got some Cyclops charging us. And then one last little guy here. And then another wave of them. Interesting. I enjoy greed mode. I really like, especially because I think part of the reason that I like greed mode is it's it's less exploration focused and more of just combat, like a combat focused aspect. So you're just shooting and uh, and just fighting like the waves, and then you get the bonuses. And it's also a lot more forgiving of mistakes, unless you like manage to like really screw it up, which is entirely possible. Um. Hopefully, that guy will bomb that guy. Nope. There we go. Trying to get rid of these little spider spawners. There's a lot of stuff. I want to leave the uh, Ipecac shooting worm around. Because he's going to do that. Don't shoot him. He's going to shoot enemies for us. Which is nice. Uh-oh. These guys are kind of scary. Ooh, how we doing? Alright, we're still alive. We're still in this. This is good. We have managed to accomplish a lot. We made it through the eight waves, and we're only down one heart. Basically. And he killed the- oh, thank you. Thank you for that. That was really nice. Alright, now for the ultimate test. I do want to buy the Halo. After the next couple of waves, but I'm going to pop in here. And... The range down, I think, is too much for this, so I'm gonna roll it. Glitter bombs! Yeah! That's good. That's... This is such a fun item. This is one of the ways you can break greed mode, you know? If you get, like, Ipecac or... Uh, Doctor's Room... Or not Doctor's Room. Doctor's Room, I guess, could work, but... Uh, Doctor Fetus or Epic Fetus, like... Or Pyro. Any way to make more bombs than you would normally have to get more consumables. It's like step one of, of breaking shit in greed mode. It's really fun. <laughs> I think that's one of the things that I really enjoy about greed mode is besides it just being combat focused, there's this element of you can, if you don't die, like there's like a 90% chance that you can break greed mode somehow. Whether it's, you know, Yara blank card or blank card to a diamonds or D20 or glitter bombs. Like there's just a lot of options to do stuff. I kind of want to use a bomb on, on like one of the Larrys, but I don't know if that's going to work as well as I think it is. So I'm just going to, until until I'm told otherwise, I'm just going to continue my shoot straight, believe in yourself kind of tactic that did not work at all. <laughs> Kill that guy. There we go. That guy's dead. Hopefully we'll get a decent devil deal. There's a tendency to get, you know, a non-item based devil deal on the first floor, and then that can send you into like... Angel rooms where they give you coins and stuff, which, while not bad, you know, precludes us from getting more items. And I just... I like to get items in greed mode. I like to get items in Isaac in general, so I think greed mode is... That's, a, like, another plus for greed mode is you just get way more items. Like, all the time items. <laughs> and if you can make some kind of, like, synergy or combination of items work together, then generally you're in a really good place. So we're going to go ahead and buy this damage upgrade. All stats up. That's pretty sweet. 
And we're fighting Lust. Just one though? Lust and Pin. Okay. I was like, shouldn't there be like two Lusts so this is at least like somewhat challenging? Especially for a Devil Deal, but that would be why, because there's Pin. Pin is also here. And Pin is a punk. I'm gonna put a bomb there. Blow you up. Yeah. Didn't give me anything. That's okay. I'm on board with that. We'll eventually get some stuff out of our glitter bombs. Uh, do I want to spend two red hearts for a soul heart through this? And the answer is no. But I do want Lord of the Pit. <clears throat> Excuse me, Lord of the Pit. Which is a really solid item. So we'll take that. And I think we'll just... We'll bomb these guys. Because one of them has... Uh, those eyes that tell me he might have a nickel in him. And instead of that, he has a soul heart, which is also really good. Not the greatest, but I mean, it's effectively a nickel in another form. So it's like, you know, a B minus instead of an A. It's not too bad. I'll take a B minus. Seems like a solid grade. Definitely take the HP up. Pop in here. Get a black heart. Ooh, a battery charge. That's exciting. We got some key possibilities here. Blow these up. Ooh, got the key. Now, here's the question. What do we do? And I think we're going to go over here and take Steven, because holy crap, that's a, that's a nice damage upgrade. Maybe not the highest damage upgrade, but it's pretty good. And we'll take a key, and we'll you know get some more money. And we'll take another key and we'll get some more money. Get away from that. <laughs> Thought it was going to explode. So it costs us... Actually, I mean, we're not positive on money, so... I think this is... Wire coat hanger probably our next thing. Can I crush all of these rocks? Is there stuff in here? We crush these mushrooms. Yeah, there's not a whole lot with Hogalaz right now. Not sure when I'm gonna want to use it. Oh my god, we spawned on that spider and he didn't do, dam he didn't do contact damage to us. That was nice of him. <laughs> I thought that was gonna be a very poor decision for us for a while there. But we're okay. Kill this, excuse me, Mr. Spider. Yes, he did, thank you. Chargers, nope. No, no, no. Not the champion. There we go. Beautiful. Oh, hey, bomb guys. Do you, you want to put some bombs over here? Like right up here by these mushrooms? Now you missed. Alright, fair enough. Let's focus fire on this guy for a while. There is... There is chaos happening now. I don't like this. Ah! I didn't see you there, bad. I was focusing on the other ones. I need... This guy dead. Oh my god, bad. Bat, come on, man. What'd I do to you? Try and take out a guy that makes more guys. <laughs> You're over here, like, throwing me under the bus. I don't need that crap. Ah, little worms. Well, little worms are dead. <laughs> May not have been my uh, proudest moment, but it worked. We'll take wire coat hanger. Ooh, pajamas, huh? We could always reroll all of this stuff, too. Did we take... Oh yeah, we took the damage. Okay, so fighting the bosses. The question here is, I guess for our devil deal, we'll take this charge in, and then we can just use it and get a free charge if we need one. And if we get something like that we could break the game with, we'll probably drop the D6 for that. Cause I, just, I mean, I love, I love breaking the game in greed mode, and if I'm given that choice probably gonna do it I think like nine out of ten times I would I would try to break greed mode if I could a little hollow action a little hollow bombs oh that was beautiful just fucking exploded his face suck on that hollow punk boom dead all right let's do this who's our boss triple sloth all right, you guys might actually hit these mushrooms then. Yeah, first mushroom down. Come on, come up, nail these mushrooms. Yeah, nail, they nail him, man. He's up here. There's mushrooms up here, man. What are you guys doing? Just having a party down there. You're all dead already. <laughs> you killed each other. I mean, I killed two of you, but one of you killed the third. Interesting. Uh, both of these are not good for us. 
Both of these are super good for us. So we'll take Dead Cat, and then we'll take Abaddon. And we're in, you know, soul heart mode, but we got a really good damage upgrade. And this would give us more soul hearts. This doesn't do anything for us. So I'm going to roll it. And we're going to buy Chaos. <laughs> and do we... I kind of want Hive Mind, but I don't know how we get Hive Mind in this instance. I don't see a way to do that. So I think we just have to say, sorry Hive Mind, we activated Chaos instead. And we'll see what kind of crazy shit happens. Chaos also doesn't guarantee, but strongly encourages something like this. Where Guppy's head appears and... And Bob's brain does. Uh, probably not going to take Bob's brain, let's be honest. But I will come back and reroll Guppy's head. And then if we get, you know, a third Guppy piece and become Guppy. Well, that's just. It's candy in the bank, man. Hagalaz. That doesn't help us. Put up these fires. Book of Sins. Uh, 15 cents for the chance to get a. What a uh, battery is probably not super good. No money out of those, really. Bombs are key. That's fine. We're going to take no with us. And the reason we're going to take no is because that gives us a pretty good chance of re-rolling. Of not re-rolling, but keeping, like, items, uh, spacebar items from spawning. Actually, no, we don't want that, do we? Hold on, let me, let me drop this over here in the corner while I'm thinking about it. Because I, I just realized we kind of want to see one of the spacebar items that would help us break the game. Like, that would be the ideal situation. Now, whether or not that happens, that's uh, a different topic. But yeah, we should probably not carry no. We should probably instead go get the, the luck upgrade in Lucky Toe. I'm not sure if your luck stat helps determine if you get any extra money on, uh, on greed mode, like from the each round. I don't know. That's a good question. That was terrible damage. <laughs> oh, this guy's, like, still here and doing stuff. Interesting. Kill this baby. Kill this guy. See? There you go. We definitely need more damage. Like, that's more damage and possibly even more tears, but I think our tears are okay. We did get Wire Code Hanger. You know, that's a decent tier upgrade. I'm a fan of it. I think it's, like... I want to say 0.5 or 6 tiers up. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, so first we want to reroll this. Champion's Belt. Oh yeah. That's that's what I'm talking about. Now you're speaking my language. Let's put a Glitter Bomb over here. What's this pill? Tears to... Oh my god, that's so bad. Uh, these all suck. But... We can buy batteries now. And that means... You know what? We'll take blue map. There's not always a secret room, but when there's a secret room, I would like to know. Secret rooms in greed mode can have some stuff. Algas. On Zeus. I guess Algas would probably be the better option here. Uh, what else? I mean, we could bomb to reroll these, but we don't have any bombs. I'll pay to reroll these. Oh, these suck too. What about like, I give you guys up to three cents. Is that enough to reroll? It is not. Dang it. All right, that may have been a mistake. We'll get we'll get a few more pennies here though. I'm trying to get a tier upgrade now because that tier down like legitimately hurt us. I'm having trouble even hitting freaking super sloth here because of it. There we go. Oh, okay. That was that was okay. We I mean our damage is amazing. Like we're. We're killing enemies really, really quickly. <laughs> Algiz? Is that really how you want to pronounce it? I'm sorry, game. I'm going to call it the Algiz room. Algiz room is, uh, is a little more inappropriate. But I think that's just because of how much shit Brownie spews. <laughs> that was a pun. Uh, I'm okay with using it to make sure that didn't happen. Uh... Four. Well, we're gonna take this and become Guppy. And we're apparently not gonna get Holy Mantle, which is kind of disappointing. But, I mean, oh, that was, that was garbage. 
But we win. <laughs> we have won. We have beaten green mode. I've had a doubt in my mind. And there was no need to buy lump of coal because Krampo gives it to you. ha 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 ha. Alright, so we're just gonna leave now. We gotta look up. Ooh, this is a room to Hogalaz. Yeah, buddy, we still got that room. Give me that. Yeah, come here. Was the other one vision? Yeah, it doesn't really do anything for me. I'm trying to think how we would use that, but it actually doesn't do anything with because we have blue map and there's only like four rooms in green mode. Uh, definitely gonna reroll that. Not gonna reroll inner eye though. Inner eye triple shot seems pretty good. It is a bit of a tears downgrade for us, so that's gonna be slightly more challenging than otherwise. Alright, so our hope is that we can get some bombs out of this room. Yeah! Nailed it! Give me this bomb. And then we can blow this up. Ah ha ha! A black heart! Don't mind if I do. Hmm. I really need to reroll that. I hate range upgrades. Oh shit, yeah! Isaac's bed, man. Get some soul hearts. Free soul hearts. That's the way to do it, man. I, I thought I pressed that. Did not. Three shots, man. Make flies. Get wrecked. Yeah, you guys do your little X shot. It's not going to save you. Your hearts can't even protect you. Not from me. I am the gup. I am he who gups in the night. I love that these guys move. It's, I don't like it like in general when I'm having a rough run, but like conceptually, I really enjoy these enemies. I don't enjoy these ones though. <laughs> Brimstone ghosts are pains in the ass. Yeah, get you guys wrecked. Get wrecked, sonny boy. Oh god, tears upgrade. Need more than anything ever, please, to be giving the tears. We're firing like at once once a second. <laughs> One Mississippi. Yeah. Just about once a second. That's uh that's a little unfortunate. Thankfully we have the money that we technically don't need to buy anything else. Oh now this now we'll at least never see Book of Sin again. That makes me feel a little bit better. And a bomb. Okay, all things considered, that's pretty solid. Uh yeah, we're not gonna buy any of these. I don't know why. I guess we're yeah, because we're not going to get another charge, so I think at this point it's just hang out and uh, kill everything. Hope we get a, you know, maybe a good devil deal. Tears upgrading our devil deal is possible now. But there's also the chance that we just don't buy anything for the rest of the run, because we could donate so much money to greed, or to the greed machine. And we need to do that to unlock Le Keeper. And, ooh, double, uh, what's your name? Fred? <laughs> Fred Jr. Fred Fredburger. Half Fred Fredburger. Can I kill you, please? Thank you. All. Hey, get out of here. Get out! Alright, now, none of this is useful. We'll blow this guy up. Infamy is alright, but I'm not going to pay three soul hearts for that. That's crazy talk. That is some crazy talk that you spouting over here. Best knock that shit off, son. Into shoal. Ooh, demon baby. Yeah, you're probably getting rerolled. If I can just be honest, that's like 75% chance. You're gonna get rerolled. Sacred Heart. Mm hmm Yeah, no, you're not getting rerolled. Ever. Uh-uh. Oh my god, we got the we got the mega tears of this is the creepiest smile on this dude's face. Let's bomb this. Release a spider. That gave me a soul heart. I'm on board with that. Screw these spiders. Kinda wanna bomb that guy. No tears upgrade still? Really? Ooh, what's in our devil deal? Just runes, huh? Just runes. 
Resistance or purity? Well, we'll use purity, get our free soul heart, and then we'll take resistance with us. And now we know we have no interest in doing the devil deal wave, because it does nothing for us. Where are you guys going? Yeah. Brimstone this. Brimstone these nuts. Oh. What up, bitch? Get out of here. Oh my god, that was terrible. <laughs> Cube of meat. You must die. I love the homing aspect of Sacred Tears. It's so nice. Excuse me. Demon. Demon baby. Yes. Can you, instead of uh, instead of doing that, can you just die instead? That'd be great. Paul. I thought he was about to die. Like, crush me. He did not. Kill these guys. Uh, okay. <laughs> I don't know how that works, but sure. There's another leech. Oh, he died on the fire. Alright. That's what I'm talking about. So, I'm gonna reroll you. Mom's box. Mm, no. Oh. Wasn't necessarily going to do that, but I did it, so it worked. And conquest. Conquest is our boss. Mm. I'm surprised you never fight like regular sa like the regular phase of Satan. You probably should be able to. Yeah, these are all just like super bad. <laughs> Alrighty then. I see what you've done. 77 cents. That's, uh, that's a pretty healthy greed donation. If I do say so myself. Which I did. Two buttons. One of those buttons was awesome. One of them was terrible. Would anyone like to guess which was which? <laughs> hmm, I like Envy. So Envy was the good one. And no. You were wrong. Envy is the worst. <laughs> Although this is not, like, as bad as it could be because we have Sacred Hearts. Still, like, one of the worst button presses I could ever imagine. <laughs> oh, we just dropped four Super Envies in the room. Are you freaking kidding me? Four Super Envies? That's some bullshit. Just get out. What's this pill do? Alright, fair enough. Hey, I like this. There are no bombs for sale, and no way to reroll this. Uh, so we're we're set with this run. <laughs> it's basically what's happened. I mean, we can reroll the shop, or we could reroll the room or the item in the curse room. Both are viable options. I don't ha really have a preference. Oh, this guy's gonna take forever. There we go. Hanging shopkeepers. I guess we'll just. We'll probably reroll the shop, that way maybe we can spend a little bit of money, so we're not wasting money, because we're definitely going to be over 99 cents by the end of this. Oh, you guys got me. Good job. You tagged me. You tricked me. Psych. Oh my, oh, I walked through that homing tier. That was, uh, that was not intentional. I feel like our, our homing tiers are a little bit slower than they need to be to hit these guys. There we go. Oh, oh my. Come on, there we go. Okay. No more no more hemorrhaging. He says as he gets hit. Okay. We're good. Let's reroll what's in here. Uh I guess like no. <laughs> I'd rather just have I'd rather waste money than buy one of those items. Cause that's just like a terrible decision. Oh, we got a lot of... I was like, there's a lot of worms. What is happening? It's frail. Frail is what's happening. Oh, this is a new... This is a new, like, setup. Instead of having the two stain with the worms, now there's three stain. That's both not better and also worse at the same time. I, I don't like that at all. <laughs> Black heart, item. Nope, bombs. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're not, I mean, we don't need any of this stuff, so I think we're just gonna leave. We'll leave those pennies. That's our tribute. It's our tribute to the spirit of greed. We have all the money in the world. Not quite a breaking run, but definitely an amazingly overpowered run. Kill all the greed heads, and we're good to go. I think once he gets to about, like, 
somewhere between 75% of his health and like 50, we'll, uh, we'll pop Algus. Or if he hits us once, we're definitely gonna pop Algus because F him in his butthole. But other than that, I'm just content to shoot a bunch of Sacred Heart tears at him. Come on, Greed. Get, yeah, get red, get angry. Rawr. I'm the Hulk, I'm always angry. Rawr. Don't spit at me, okay? That's not called for. Just take that crap and like go somewhere else with it. What else you got? You know what? I'm just gonna sit on your butt. Let's do this. How long can I can I kill you before Algiz runs out? This is the test. Get all of these guys. Ugh, our tier rate is like atrociously bad. I don't know if this is possible. I'm going to guess not because of how low our tier rate is. Probably if we had a slightly higher tier rate, maybe. But the flies have got to be helping, right? No, oh my god. We basically did like 25% of his health. That was a terrible decision. These are my pennies. You cannot have them. Yeah, blow yourself up, buddy. How about that? No, no money dropped from that explosion? Interesting. I would have thought you would have blown, like, a couple of the shopkeepers up and got some money out of that Ultra Greed. Uh-uh. Nope. Those ones hurt. You can keep those key, or those coins, the fudge away from me. Alright, so we've lost two pennies. It's not the end of the world. Although I need to get better at, like, dodging his attacks. Because I want to be able to beat Greed with the Lost eventually. And that would require... Taking, like, literally no damage. Unless we get, like, some kind of... Uh, I want to... I kind of want to break some of these keys. Yeah. Okay, some of the keys can be broken. There we go. He's dead. I don't know what killed him, but he died. So, good job. 541 coins. We got a 1% chance to jam. Let's see how many coins the machine will let us get. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this run. If you did, please leave a like. Let me know what you thought in the comments below. And uh, on Thursday we'll be doing more greed. And tomorrow we'll just be doing some regular afterbirth. We're getting pretty close to that. Ah, 571. It only lets donate like 30 coins though. That's kind of sad. With a 2% chance, we must have just gotten really unlucky. Oh well. Uh, but yeah, we'll just we'll keep grinding there. We're getting we're getting closer to that keeper unlock, which is kind of exciting. And then we I've never played with them, so we'll see what happens then. Anyways, I'll see you guys next time. Later.